station on Space to Ground. Welcome to Space to Ground. I'm Kayla LaFrance. This week, the crew on board was hands-on science. Microgravity provides a unique environment to study dexterous manipulation in an experiment called GRIPS. European Space Agency astronaut Alex Gerst spent time investigating the effects of long-duration spaceflight on humans' ability to grip and manipulate objects. Not only will the GRIP study help researchers understand the long-term adaptation of GRIP force and load force coordination that astronauts face, it could also help contribute to the design and control of intelligent haptic interfaces to be used in challenging environments such as deep space as NASA aims to return to the Moon, Mars, and beyond. As the International Space Station closes in on the 18th anniversary of humans living continuously on board, our views inside have never been better. While your neighborhood digital cinemas typically project films in 2 to 4K resolution, this week NASA delivered the first ever 8K footage of astronauts living, working, and conducting research aboard the orbiting laboratory. Thanks to the Helium 8K camera by RED, a digital cinema company, Fans of science and space will now be able to follow along in fast-moving footage in even higher definition. Veteran NASA astronaut Mike Hopkins will be riding SpaceX's Crew Dragon to his next long-term stay on the station and is training for his roles once on board. He recently spent time in NASA's Active Response Gravity Offload System, or ARGOS, to practice spacewalking in microgravity conditions. To see the latest as we get closer to these first flights from SpaceX and Boeing, visit nasa.gov slash commercial crew. Keep sending in your questions using the hashtag space to ground. We'll see you next week.